Hi everybody, um, this is Maria from your encyclopedia, um, and today I want sort of a few things. First I want to show you sort of a room tour before I change my room because hopefully I'm going to be able to change it so that my bed is sort of like a couch and I'm going to have a little bit more room in my room because honestly this is a tiny room. From that corner all the way around. This is honestly a tiny room especially for a girl like me so i'm gonna show you a room tour before i change it and give it a little bit more room and a little bit more better feel um and i'm also going to ask you a few questions about how i can improve my room to give me more space and not look as ugly so if i come out here here's the hall that my room leads from so, this is our room, and you walk in, and there's a cabinet right there. Currently, I've got a dress hanging on it because I haven't put it up yet. But here's the door, which you don't usually see. But yeah, I've got a little thing up there that says, Always kiss me goodnight, and then that one says princess, and this is the bathroom door. But anyway, so, you walk in, you see my bed. There's my bed. And, um, under the, these covers, I've got little drawers under there to hold my clothes to save some space. On the other side, i got sort of stuff like that. Back here's the light, so you can cut it on and off. And I've got a little, um, a little light there. It's sort of like a reading light, but since it's sort of bright and all, and I sort of like to keep my room sort of dark and cozy, um, I've just got that. I usually keep that on. I've got a bunch of bows and plates here. Plates, I don't know where I got it from, but I do. And then I've got um, a whiteboard calendar that I got from a Christian lifestyle, Christian store or something. And then I got a poster. And then down here, I've got a, another whiteboard. Here's a chalkboard and some bags and stuff. And then that's a little cupboard, like um, a cupboard or a, um, I don't know what you call it. It's, uh, right, I don't know, my brain just goes blank sometimes, but anyway, it's a big, um, thing, closet, sort of like a closet, and I can just put my stuff in there, but it's really cluttered, which is a good thing it has doors. Then I've got a trash can there, and also a little horse pony thing, so there's my bed, and then you can walk around to the other side of my room. This leads into the bathroom, so... And then that door over there leads to my brother's room. But yeah. So if you walk this way, which is pretty much the only way that you have. So there's the door that you walk through. And then you walk this way. And that's my closet. I think it's probably the junkiest part of my room. I don't know what to do with my closet. I mean, the junky part isn't really my clothes. My clothes isn't the junky part. But I have a ton of... Like, I have so much stuff that I don't know where to put it. And I just shove it in my closet sometimes. Like, um, my guitar. I don't have anywhere to put it, so it has to go in my closet. I also have some doll stuff. Don't know where to put it. Has to go in my closet. There's some doll stuff. That's sort of doll stuff. And then all of that right back there is a doll bed. Then I have my violin. Where do I put my violin? And my guitar. And just help me organize my closet, guys. Because it really needs organizing. I mean, it looks pretty okay if you take my violin out. And then you close it. And I don't even know if I can close this door. Yeah, I can. But anyway. It looks pretty okay when it's closed. But then... I mean, I do have more space while it's closed, too, but then I have to have somewhere to put my violin, and still, I need to get in my closet sometimes. Plus, I'm always leaving it open, because I gotta go in there. Then that's a fairly cluttered space. I just got finished sort of cleaning my room, so this is what it looks like when it's clean, guys. Enjoy. Because <laughs> that's not gonna last long. Anyway, so, there's baby crib, baby stuff. I've got this Harry Potter thing. 
and I've just got clutter all over my room, and I really want to fix it. Then I've got this baby clothes bag, netting stuff, and this is my stuffed animal, so maybe moving that will help a little bit. But, yeah. So this is it, and I really need to clean out this. My closet probably can wait because I can just shut the doors and it's not messed up. But this part might be the most cluttered and least helped part, and then so is under there. Okay, so there's my closet and all. Then you come this way, and I'll show you my desk area. I've got a nice cute chair, and one, one thing, this is sort of a tip on how to keep your room clean. If you've got jack jackets and stuff and you don't have room in your closet or you don't feel like putting them up at the moment or you just don't know where to put them, stick them under your chair, like on top of your chair, and then lay a blanket over it. It's really good cushion. I love cushioning my chair. And then there's my purse down there. Over here, I like a lot. It's just pretty much just a crate. Then instead of this part is the bottom. So, right here. So, instead of having the bottom on the floor, it's up on the side. So, it makes it so that I can have this little room area, sort of. And it's fun to have. If you've got kids, it's a fun thing to do to keep them putting their stuff up. And it's fun to use. Then, if you've got kids and you're homeschooling them or they need somewhere to put their math book and all, put some um, book covers on it. It makes it fun, and it makes the kids seem like they're older and more mature. I've got some stuff on top of it, and then all that. So, it's beside my bed, as you can see. And then here's my desk up here. I've got a monitor, and then there's a computer. There's a computer. I've got another stuffed animal. And I've just got clutter, pretty much, in that area. I don't know where to put anything. And then, if I can move my chair out of the way a little bit down here like I've got this thing it slides out and it gives me a little bit of room but then under here it's like so cluttered and I don't know where to put everything and I put some stuff under there but it's not really helping a whole bunch so and then I've got my purse and a lap loom so yeah and yeah by the way, one thing to do if you've got a desk in the back, which my back is showing, but the back of my desk does show, but if the back isn't really, if it's covered by stuff and all, and you can't really see it as much, then you can run the cords from your computer behind it so it doesn't show and it's not as bad looking. Anyway, so there's my closet and then this way's my desk. And then here's my bookcase. I've got a mini Hello Kitty fridge up here, which I completely love because, like, I am in love with Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty is so cute. And then I've got a lava lamp. That's pretty cluttered, too, but not as cluttered as other stuff. And then I've got my books and clutter all up and down. And I tried to clean this up a bit. I mean, I promise you, this looks better than it did. Then that corner just got a bunch of junk in it. Against the wall, that's the cord for my computer, but against the wall, I've got stuff that I don't know where to put it. So I have no, I have nowhere to put that stuff. And then I've got all this in my trash can again, another trash can because I got one right there. But yeah. And by the way, here's a tip for you guys. Um, if you put something like, something that doesn't look so good like that stuff if you put it behind something like that pillow it look, makes it look better anyway so down here there's that light that I was talking about down here I've just got something hanging from a headboard and then down here is my dresser I don't have a lot of room to do anything here but I've got you know there looks a little bit better um, I've got this thing. This actually went on top of that little thing right there that goes like that. Um, it was in the bathroom. I know, right, gross? And then I've got that, just books and stuff in there, like little things. 
statuettes and stuff that my brother gave me. Brothers gave me inside there. And stuff like that. Um, my DS, my DSi, and my 3DS. This thing really hates me, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Yeah. Alright, anyway, so I got some books and stuff. And then up there, I've got, just got a picture, some pictures and stuff. Then I got some books across there to keep stuff less messy. And a towel and stuff. And then I got all that. This is also where I keep some of my clothes. The top drawer has my pants, and then that, both of those are sort of miscellaneous. This is a sort of good way to keep clutter from showing. Ta-da! All my clutter's in there. So, keep something in front of all your clutter so it doesn't look bad. I'm hoping to take out the stuff down there and put it somewhere, which, I know, that's a stupid idea, huh? Because I don't have anywhere to put anything. But... Then I can take some cardboard and put one strip there, one there, one across there, and then one under it. And stick some shoes in there in the little slots. So maybe that'll help. But help me organize my stuff. So here's some stuff that I need organized. My closet and that area. I also need under my desk. Then my bookcase and that corner. So... Pretty much the corners. That's a whole corner right there. And then that little pot spot and then that. So I really need help organizing and uncluttering and stuff like that. So please help me with this guys. I hope you enjoyed my room tour and I hope y'all can help me and I can help you. So thanks for watching. Remember to thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. Bye, everybody.